Welcome to 99th Monkey Liberty News for Tuesday, July 22nd, 2014. I'm beginning today with this video that was produced by InfoWars, How Matt Drudge Changed the World. And this is a, a very encouraging video, kind of an overview. Um, it's a, it almost feels in watching this as if Alex is kind of looking at where we are in the struggle and uh, seeing that uh, he doesn't say this, but there's almost a sense that we've turned some kind of a corner and uh, that that the truth message is being effectively communicated and that people are beginning to pick up on it. And Don just alerted me to this. Uh, Goldman Sachs Managing Director Nicholas Valtz found dead, and this is from Bloomberg. Not a conspiracy theory, this is uh, real. So he was out kite surfing and, uh, and was found dead. Benjamin Fulford's blog came out rather late yesterday, pretty much early evening California time. It's uh, it's an interesting one this week. It's, it seems like there's a lot of good news. Um, he's kind of suggesting that significant change will come in the fall. And of course, he's said things like that before, and the, the times came and went without the significant change. But there is kind of a sense of, of a shift in many respects. One specific thing that he talked about uh, was, uh, second paragraph, the downing of remote-controlled Israeli-owned so-called Malaysian Airlines Flight MH17 filled with dead and decomposing bodies was one dirty trick too many for the Nazianists, and a turning point against them has now been reached within the world's secret agencies and governments, according to multiple sources. Uh, this isn't something that's been absolutely proven, that the flight was uh, filled with dead bodies, but I, I did mention yesterday the plot of a Sherlock episode that included that as a part of the story. And uh, yeah, just for fun, I decided to find those instances. And uh, it was in a scandal in Belgravia. And uh, here's a, a YouTube clip that is from the scene. On um, it, it doesn't really, at this particular moment, you don't get to see the the bodies that have been loaded on the plane, and they don't discuss it. But um, if you happen to have Netflix and you want to watch a scandal in Belgravia, um, this this is the scene that that you would look for to find the part about the the dead bodies. And again, yes, it's fiction, but art comes from somewhere. This is. Uh, Kawhi Lapele's blog that contains comments written by David Wilcock on Benjamin Fulford's article. And I always find these interesting. I, I always look for them, and I found them on Benjamin Fulford's actual blog, but it's just easier to present them here uh, via Kawhi Lapele. And what is in italics here is what he has picked out. Uh, it, I it, I wanted to read the entire comment and actually more than one comment written by David Wilcock and there's a lot of interesting information here he has written a lot about disclosure uh, being coming soon I am withholding opinion about that I definitely believe that uh, God's holy angels are ministering justice to the earth, and uh, that might maybe those angels are what what some people would say are going to be disclosed. I uh, again, I don't have strong opinions about aliens one way or the other, but I did 
I did find these comments interesting and uh, on balance encouraging. And there is some interesting solid good news this morning and uh, I'm keeping this video short today. I just uh, the things that that caught my eye um, seemed like they deserved the the focus of not being crowded in with a lot of other issues. Uh, this is from World Net Daily, but there are a lot of articles about this on Drudge, and uh, you probably will want to read several of them to piece together the story. Appeals court deals huge blow to Obamacare, strikes down IRS rule allowing subsidies in federal exchange. And this is an article that InfoWars has about the same ruling. Obama's law professor, I wouldn't bet on Obamacare's survival. I wouldn't bet the family farm on this coming out in a way that preserves Obamacare, he says. So some of the headlines are Obamacare received a death blow, Obamacare won't survive, um, and it, it really strongly appears as if Obamacare is collapsing. Um, so of course there's going to be wreckage in its wake and uh, something will need to be pieced back together um, for Medicare, Medicaid, and, and the services that already were in place. Hopefully the veterans will be able to find the care that they so badly need. Thank you for tuning in for today's 99th Monkey Liberty News. Weeping may endure for a night, but joy comes in the morning. Hoping that you will love one another, take care, and enforce the Bill of Rights.